What's up? It's your boy Marcus, aka M Dub, aka Big Time, and today I'm gonna be recording my daily fitness blog for bio class to show you what's rocking out here. So, first question: What do you discover after recording data for day one? I tested my <clears throat> resting heart rate, and I noticed after the first test that I have a low heart rate already. So, I mean, wow. Well, I mean, I'm already in shape. You know, you know what I'm saying? I'm already in shape, but so for that, it's a low resting heart rate, so I like to maintain that or either improve that. So, second, are you eating healthy? Yes, I'm eating healthy. Start my day off with a bowl of fruit. So, I eat that first. I usually wake up at 7 a.m. in the morning. I eat my fruit first and let that digest. You know, they say it's always good to eat the fruit first. I did a lot of research, and once I t tapped in with that, I figured that was the best idea and best way to go. So I eat my fruit, wait about an hour, and then I um, I eat avocado on toast with a, a fried egg. So that's that complete my breakfast, and I'll maybe throw in some Greek yogurt and some granola here and there, you know? Am I drinking enough water? <sighs> a gallon, a gallon a day keeps the doctor away. You know what they say, man. So. I'm drinking, yes, I'm drinking enough water. I drink a gallon a day, I sweat a lot. So I gotta keep hydrated and it's important. I really like emphasizing, sometimes I always should also try to drink a smoothie at night, you know, cause I promote hydration for the next day. You know, falling asleep with a smoothie? They're really gonna dig deep in themselves, you know what I'm saying? Whew, are you getting enough physical activity? Yes, boy, I'm getting too much probably. For real, for real, if we're being honest, you know, we, practice you know i gotta practice so that's what i said in my thing i'll be playing basketball and running so i calculated probably through practice i probably run about four or five miles you know we'd be getting up and down that's not every day and you know but on an average every day at least a mile for sure and so you know one of the goals for me is to test like see how i feel it's a mental a mental approach to it really i was just trying to see how i feel throughout the practice i don't want to be tired you know and it's also here and there goes into recovery by my body as well. Um, sleep, yes. Did I get enough sleep? I ain't gonna cap. I don't be getting enough sleep. Not all the time, you know. And know they say, doctors say, what, eight hours a day? <clears throat> I don't get eight hours a day. I, I know that. I ain't gonna cap to you. I ain't gonna cap to you eight hours a day. And nah, I don't get that. But um, first off, my I could improve there. I probably get, on average, probably like six hours. But... I can probably prove there. I have, I'm keeping a track of my health app. My health app says that I get enough sleep throughout the day. I have to get eight hours to maintain a good, um, what's it called? Uh, I think it's called a good rest cycle. So, but and that's what I can, that's the area I can improve is so I can get eight hours of sleep a day. Um, my goals, so one of my first goals is to eat three meals a day you know, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and make sure I'm getting three whole meals and always eating some of color in there, like greens, beans, or something, and I get a protein with it, and also drinking a lot of water with it. So my goal is to three, three, three meals a day, and another goal is to drink a gallon of water a day. I know the gallon of water is very hard a day, you know, especially because you, you have to essentially start in the morning at an early time, and sometimes that can be very, very difficult. And sorry, I have to do that. I'm trying to keep up with the questions. But um, a gallon of the day keeps the doctors away. So that's definitely one of the goals. Um, so like I got to I calculated ever earlier about average and practice around about three, four miles. Um, so my goal is to then after practice at a later night, run a mile. And I want to run a mile in six minutes, under six minutes. So. That's a goal I have in mind by the end of this. Um, also, I'm, I did cut all carbonated beverages out of my diet. And so a goal for me is not to have none, no carbonated uh, carbonated beverages. Um, but also my fitness goals, My one of my, I incorporated in my fitness blog, I want to stretch every day. It's important that you stretch, you know? So I think that's one of the things I add to one of my goals, to fitness goals, to at least stretch for 30 minutes a day, 
you know, if I can if I can stretch and I'm flexible, what flexible and athletic? I mean, that's crazy. So, but keeping these hips, you know, what they say all, all your stress, all that stuff is in your hips. So, I definitely want to, um, you know, focus on stretching, stretching the hips and the glutes. So I gotta be, I wanna be like a noodle, you know. So. But hey, we're gonna check back in at the end of this diary video vlog, dog vlog, whatever you wanna call it. So thanks for checking in with Big Time End Up. Um, we'll see y'all long. Y'all have a good day.